always play. When you start getting good at other positions, you know what I mean, you may end up playing something similar and you just slide right into getting underneath them. So what am I doing with De La Hiva, really? I'm engaging with him, but I don't want him to get away. So that's why we wrap. One leg always gets wrapped behind, and that's your hook. You're gonna grab that leg. Even if he wanted to get away from here and have no other grips, just by having his leg hooked and foot here, if he wanted to try to bail, go ahead. Okay, he's kind of helping me just sink it in better. He turned the angle for me, and now I can start establishing my grips. Now I can start moving around, doing whatever I want. Okay, this is your entrance here. This is your De La Hiva. Okay, so we're here now. We're pushing far here. Again, I have long legs, so I can maybe push a little lower than some of you guys. Some guys may have to get a little higher. Okay. Um, if you really just can't stretch this person out at all, so go ahead and pull your leg in. Um, this, one. this one? Yeah, let's just say I had a really, really small leg here, and I'm right here, and I'm trying to push. And my leg, that's it. Like, this is literally how, how far my leg is. <laughs> then I would transition immediately to a tilting back motion, which will be our first one. So we're here. If you're able to stretch them out or not, doesn't matter. You're going to shoot that hip through. And you don't want it too low, right? All he's going to do is literally look at it. It's going to fall down. I need to shoot it up right on the crook of his hip here. And what I'm going to do is try to tilt him right back like that. Okay, I showed you guys the super easy way to come up. We basically have this leg pinned already on this side. So it's literally just picking yourself up right into your mouth. Also showing you guys how to bear and bolo. Um, yeah, we'll get right into that too. So go back up. So same thing, we're here. We come to the De La Hiva super baby style butterfly hooks. Make my grips, I get comfortable, I go cool. Controlling position, controlling position. Start moving my hips. So I'm just working my way and finessing my way into De La Hiva. Now I'm in the right spot. Now I can push, come up, even come up for a single leg or a back attack. But here we're gonna go back, shooting through, stomping here, and we're just tilting them back. That's all we're doing right here. So when we stop here, we're going to redirect our back down to the mat, right to a back take. Do not overthink it. Literally, just sit on your butt. Me? Yeah. So I end up sweeping them like this. Boom, right? Came this way, right? Everybody got me? I still had this hand. I'm going to slide my body under. I never looked down at the ground. My back stayed on the mat, and I'm literally grabbing and with this leg, kind of shucking him for our back take. Now he's being like dead weight right now, but as you're moving, it's crazy. A little bit of movement, they like slide right into a perfect back take. But that's a little too much. No big deal. We'll come in. We'll shoot off. Right? And you just literally hop right on top. I already had his leg pinned, so why not take it? If you want to start 